In this video, I'll be talking about negative feedback and how to handle mitigation with people online. Now, a lot of people in business think that this is a really bad thing, like this is a taboo subject. I think it's a wonderful opportunity because if there are legitimate complaints about your business, people can come forward and tell you and you can actually mitigate that. You can find out what the problem is and fix it internally. Um, so it's a really good opportunity. And the first step I would say for anyone who gets negative feedback is to take a step back, stop, take all emotion out of it and think about what that person just said and come back with a professional comment and find out what the situation was. So at that point, everyone else that sees these comments and how you're responding as a business will see that you care. And then you can ask the person who has the specific complaint to either contact you privately via you know, inbox, message, phone, email, um, come into your business and you can resolve the situation. And this is a really good opportunity. So I think that you can either find out really what went on, you can negotiate the situation on, you know, what is it that, it was this a legitimate complaint? And you can address it properly with the person one-on-one. -on -one. Um, and, you know, for most businesses out there, I think that they're concerned about negative feedback, but m most of the time, and what I'm seeing in business is that if people complain, it is a fairly legitimate complaint. There's not too many out there where there's just trolls just out there to ruin your business. It's, it's not as prominent as people think, but it's a wonderful opportunity for you to show to wider audiences and other people thinking about your business that you care that this shows your process and how you're dealing with things. Um, and also you can resolve things and tweak things in your business as you need to on the go.